after school, did you ha have a special hangout with your friends? Tony hung out, it seemed like, at her friends' house, houses, in indoors. Did you hang out at any, like... Oh, well, we used to do that, but we used to always, uh, see, like, it was one church, or two churches in Pasadena. We could go and play basketball <clears throat> after school and in the evenings. And then uh, I uh, involved with the Boy Scouts and things like that. <laughs> Did you spend a lot of time outdoors? Did you go camping? Because mm -hmm. um, I'm finding that when I interview people, that they spent a lot more time with their child that they're growing up yeah. doing things outside. Like when you were at a training camp and you spent a lot of time in the mountains. That yeah, seemed like we a used to go up to hike up um, before there was really an Andrews, Andrews Crest Highway. In fact, it was only two lanes. And then we used to hike up Mount Low. Mm -hmm. The railway is the old railway. You heard about that too? I've hiked up there. Yeah. That's a hard hike. Well, you, you, if you're young and whatnot, it's not bad. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. another thing that would come. He was an Eagle Scout, and I was a Mariner Scout. So, so what yeah. did the scouting do for you both? I think it helped me in some ways of doing different things, respecting other people. Mm -hmm. See, I don't know how those scouts are <clears throat> today, but... There was a lot more involvement with adults and parents. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. My mother was a Cub Scout leader and a Girl Scout leader, mm -hmm. so I spent a lot of time with her doing scouting. Yeah. And, and, uh, it, it's an opportunity to have other parents as, um, I mean, other mm -hmm. adults as kind of mentors and role models. And then it's a good way to bond with your own. Friend, you know, mm -hmm. your own friends, and then the opportunity to um, to go to go places. And I had the experience of going on the Brigantine Yankee twice, and um, but just out in New Bedford for two or Gloucester, I should say, for two weeks of time. But then I had the opportunity to go around the world with them, and my parents said, you know. Too much. No, you're going to go to school, you know, blah, 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 because they pick their people based on uh, know your ability to get along with other people because mm -hmm. they could train you, you know, do this. But, um, you know, so, because I'm kind of the show me, you know, I should have been, show me, you know, mm -hmm. and that's how I learn. I don't, I don't learn well from other <laughs> people. I have to learn the hard way, you know. But, um, That's the so, best way to learn. I think all, you know any no. program with Boy Scouts or well, for Girl computers Scouts, oh. or you know Boys and Girls Club mm -hmm. or whatever that um, and I think other parents are very important, mm -hmm. not just professionals. You know, I, that's just my opinion. I think that was you know I still am close to some of my friends' parents. Me too. I have, they have this thing um, that the YMCA put out called Indian Guides and Indian Maidens, uh -huh. I don't know if you know, but each group, like it would be like a Cub Scout, instead of a troop, you were a Native American tribe and you had to research that mm -hmm. tribe, and it was all girls or all boys, and um, my mom and I, I'm, I know I'm not supposed to be talking, but my mom and I were in that, and I'm still really good friends with one of the ladies in there, and mm -hmm. not her daughter necessarily, her daughter's we're total opposites, but I can talk to her mom about anything. Yeah, yeah, and that's, I think that's important mm -hmm. growing up, especially if you don't come from, you know, a really solid Definitely. home. You need to have other adults mm -hmm. out there to talk to, mm -hmm. most definitely. And those who aren't paid to do it either, and are, right. you know, doing a job. Right. 